<laughs> oh my goodness. Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the Let's Play. Ah guys, it's been such an awesome uh, series so far and I've been doing a lot of work. Hello kitty kitty, you gotta stop this midnight. You gotta stop interrupting the intro. <laughs> but welcome back everybody to a brand new episode of the Survival Let's Play. You guys have made this a successful Let's Play already and I want to thank you so much guys for the love and support so far. <laughs> so I have cats everywhere guys. I have four now. Just uh, one more from early, from last time but I've got them everywhere. I got one here. I got one down there. I'm trying to protect myself guys. I am fighting a back against creepers this season. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get into the episode. So here I've made a new bulletin board and uh, I want to say a huge shout out to 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 the person that suggested this to me um, which I think is a great idea. I, I don't know why I didn't start this months ago but Let's go ahead and go over some of the goals I've set for myself and for us. Um, okay, so these are no in particular, no particular order, but um, basically what I want to do is uh, I want to uh, make a jukebox, get a music disc, build a fishing hut, make a veggie farm, build a nether portal, build a subby wall, and find a village. Building a subby wall is going to be the most vital and important thing because I haven't done that in so long. I used to do subby walls all the time. And I love doing it. It's a way, it's a great way to interact with you guys. And I think you guys are going to love it. So the music, the make a jukebox and make a, and get a music disc. Now making a jukebox is easy. It's simple. I have diamonds. I have six diamonds to be exact. So we can spare one for that. And now building a fishing hut. I have kind of already started building that. And I'll show you guys momentarily. Um, and make a veggie farm. I think those are the three things we're going to do today. Um, so, <clears throat> I want to try and get a record. I wonder, it is nighttime right now, because the cats are here, I don't think the creepers are going to come down here, but we are going to try this on our own. If we could find a skeleton that will <clears throat> take out a creeper for us. Look, there's a creeper right there. I was not ready. I was not ready for this. Oh, where is it? Where is it? Oh, good grief. This video is going to be so dark. This is going to be one of the darkest videos I've ever made. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh, I need a skeleton. I need a skeleton, guys. No zombies. Is there a skeleton down there? Oh my goodness. That creeper. He must have been just hanging out. He was waiting for me. He was too scared of the cats. He didn't want to come anywhere near me. We're going to get a record. We're going to get a record. Oh no. Oh wait, he's shooting him. He's shooting him. He keeps. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Dude, this creeper is not dying. Oh. He killed him. Oh gosh, okay. Now we're going to see if we can get a record. Did we get a record? We got a record, guys. We got a record. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. Oh, we got a record. Wait, I don't know what I don't know what record that is. <laughs> oh my god, this is awesome, guys. Oh, you have no idea how long I've been waiting, almost dying. Oh my gosh, I've been here stuck in this corner for like I don't even know how for how long. Look at this mess over here with cobble. <laughs> oh my god, I can't believe that creeper got stuck in there. Honestly, I didn't think he was going to follow me as far as he did. Oh my gosh, guys. That was the longest that was the longest like 30 minutes probably of my life seriously all right so now let's make a jukebox so we got for we got the first one accomplished okay um all right let's see where are my diamonds i have diamonds here there we go one diamond and then i think it's just one diamond and then you gotta surround it with wood so there we go and then we got plenty of wood here there's our jukebox guys <laughs> Oh, this is awesome. Where's Toucan? Oh, he's gonna be so excited. Oh my gosh. I can't believe we have a jukebox guys This is awesome and a jukebox in pocket edition. Well windows pocket edition. Where is where's Toucan? Oh gosh, don't tell me he's gone Don't tell me something happened to him. Oh good grief. I think he's over here. Oh, there he is What is he doing? 
He's ready to take flight, I guess. There he is. He's on my shoulder. <laughs> oh, where can we set this up? Let's set up your little dance floor right here. Oh, you stop it. Come here. Come here. Well, come on. <laughs> He's back on my shoulder. Wait. I gotta. I need you to sit down. Sit down, please. Sit down right there. Right there, perfect. Okay, so here's your jukebox, and let's get going. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh my god, this is so cute! I can't stand it! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I can sit in and watch Toucan forever, guys! I'm so happy right now. I don't think I've ever been so happy in Minecraft. Never. Sorry, bro. There we go. <laughs> Remix. Just kidding. I'm sorry, Toucan. I'll leave you to it. <laughs> oh my god, that's so awesome. Okay, I'm gonna take this. This I know. I know. Party pooper. I'm gonna take this, though. Just in case. Oh man, that was too good. Thank you, Tcan. You're cute. Okay, let's get downstairs. <clears throat> Actually, you know what? We need to remove that sign. We've accomplished one goal for today, and that was to make a jukebox and get a disc. I can't believe we got a disc. I just, I still can't believe it. Honestly, I thought I was gonna die before I even got one. That was not as simple as I thought. Getting a creeper and getting a skeleton together it was very hard. But it was worth it. <laughs> All right. So build a fishing hut. All right. <clears throat> so like I said earlier that I did start making one. Um, probably needs a little bit of work though. I'll show you guys what I'm talking about. So I was trying to go for just, you know, something a little bit different. I wanted to make the style a little different. Basically using the spruce colors and then using the jungle wood colors, you know, because, you know, we're in the jungle. We're going to have to use like jungle wood colors and spruce and jungle wood are probably the two that look together. Like they look the best. I've tried mix matching with the other colors and I just don't like them. I don't know. So, <clears throat> excuse me. Let me make sure there's no creepers down here. Oh, look, there's more lava back here. Um, but anyways, here's the fishing hut. Let me just take a step back so you guys can take a look at it. Very cool. I mean, you got the little log sticking out top. The roof is pretty much the same all the way around, you know. Um, why do I? Why don't I do something like this? I should have brought Toucan down here with his jukebox. He probably would have loved that. Um, what am I trying to get? What did my? Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Okay, cool. Um, all right. So let's go ahead and get the stairs going like that. And then we'll move. How about we move that? Move that like that. Yeah. Okay. I like that better. It was looking a little strange. I was trying to make it look different, but to be honest, I think this looks the best. Doing it in that little direction there. Yeah, that looks pretty cute. Um, I do want to, however, bring the logs up just a little bit more. I'm so happy we got a disc, guys. Like I'm still on that, you know. Oh, that laugh, though. Oh, it was so good. Toucan was so cute. Alright, let's uh, remove all this right here. Okay, and then we'll do that. Like so. <clears throat> okay, that's going to be the little sunroof. I think I have a trap door. Nope, I don't have trap doors. If I could get a trap door going... Oh, you know, we could put a fence in there. What, a, what would a fence look like? Let's see here. Does that look strange? It looks like it has an antenna or something. <laughs> oh, let's do that. No, let's just do that. Yeah, there we go. We don't need all that fence stuff. We could always add it later though. Because I do want to add in like the fences and stuff. Kind of like it did the houses up top. I think we should definitely do that. I like the twig look. It has like twigs and stuff hanging out of it. That's what it looks like to me. Hmm. What do you guys think? Maybe it's too high. It's hard to tell from this direction. Let's go over here. Yeah, might be a little too much. Just a little bit. Unless we add some more leaf blocks, it won't really matter if we add like leaf blocks and stuff. Well, we'll have to, like, we'll have to definitely do that. 
But for the meantime, let me go ahead and get all this fixed right here first because I'm just kind of jumping along and doing different things. <laughs> so, <clears throat> the subby wall as well. Um, I want to discuss that. Okay, so a lot of you guys are new you know you're new to the channel so you're probably not familiar with my wall of subbies um it's something that i done i've done like the last few seasons um kind of stopped doing it this last season season two but i want to bring it back <clears throat> but what i did was i basically just picked people that commented and kind of showed me i guess basically kind of stood out in my comments there are a lot of you guys that you know comment very frequently and i i've got to know you you know i'm, I'm used to you guys commenting and and uh, definitely into that or uh, definitely oops let's use the jungle instead i like the jungle green in there yeah there we go um but you some of you guys are just uh constantly commenting and leaving so much love on the channel i definitely always remember you guys so people like that um i tend to add to my wall of subbies that's basically how you get on um very simple i mean i think that a lot of people do that's basically how a lot of people add um so people add people that donate you know stuff like that um i don't really i don't ever ask for donations i would never ask for donations i know it's hard um, <laughs> uh, times are hard. I would never ask anybody for donations. Um, but, so that's not a way to do it. Oh my gosh, come on. Can I place this correctly? Let's try this again. We'll put it right here. There we go. Perfect. Hmm. We can add this there. And then we can go boom, boom, all the way across. I kind of don't like it in the corners. Yeah, I don't like it in the corners. Let's just remove it from right here. Fantastic. All right, so we got this little covered cover on it. Yeah, there you go. It's really simple. Very, very simple. There we go. Do the little twig thing that I was talking about. Go boom, boom. There we go. Yeah. Fan freaking tastic. You know, we could even use some of these uh, extra stairs that we have here that I made. Oh, yeah, that looks cool. I definitely like that. Hmm, we could put in something like that. And then over here as well, we can put in like a stair here. We can even put a stair down here. Yeah, there we go. That looks pretty cool. It looks like a shack, <gasps> like a little fishing shack. I like that a lot. And then this over here, we can go like this. Yeah, there we go. Okay, that's looking a lot, lot better. And then over here in the little uh, doorway, let's go ahead and shoot for some more jungle wood over here. This stuff is so awesome. I love, I love this color. Oh, I feel only this was in, in the actual game. I think you guys would be pretty happy with it. Some of you guys don't like it. I know, I understand. We're used to certain, well, we're used to one thing and we're not used to, you know, we don't like change. I know, I get it. <laughs> Some people don't like change. They don't like texture packs. That's cool. I mean, I like, I don't, I'm not, I was never a big, huge, like, I wasn't a huge fan of texture packs. Except for, um, I like John Smith, but I would always kind of go back to my original texture pack. Did I really eat all that food already? Jeez. Okay, I think we've done all that we can do for now. Um, I think I should go ahead and put a door here in the front just in case. Because it's easy to get up here and don't want any mobs coming in here. Um, before I starve though, and before we have to head back upstairs really quickly, let's go ahead. Oh, good grief. <laughs> all of this obsidian makes me nervous. I wanted to make sure all of it was uh, just obsidian. Okay, let's go ahead and just fill all this in with jungle wood. Yeah, that looks nice. And then we can actually go ahead and... Oh, it's raining again. It's always raining. Oh, good grief. And then let's go ahead and grab our chest here. So we can put in our uh, fishing poles. I don't have anything for fishing poles just yet. Unfortunately. Oh my goodness. Let's sleep. Okay, we'll put some lights in here. Cool. So now we have our fishing hut. Oh, and the thunder is monstrous. It's scary. There we go. Nice little fishing hut for us to get started. I love that look. That looks absolutely nice. You know what we could do as well is, let's like, like I said, 
earlier. <laughs> I kind of forgot. Um, we have some jungle leaves here. <clears throat> we could throw a little bit on top here to kind of give it some, uh, just, just to make it look nice. You could just do something like that. I used to do stuff like this all the time. Corrales taught me this, guys. By the way, he's like uploading Minecraft again. That's awesome. Whoops, wasted. There we go. There we go. That that looks so much better. Guys, seriously. Are you serious? Slimes. Oh man. Okay, we got to get some we got to get some food. We got to get some food. That's oh man. Hello, guy. Oh god, you're huge. So, like, there has to be a chunk here, right? That's what this means. There's a slime chunk nearby. I thought they, I thought these only spawn in swamps. I guess I could be wrong about a lot of things about Minecraft. I'm such a noob. Seven. Okay. And <laughs> when I'm a noob about things, you, a lot of you guys are quick to let me know. <laughs> it's so awesome. You guys are funny. Okay. Okay, we're good. We got some slimes. That's awesome. I'm so glad. We got. We can make some leads. Um, that's great. So, we're good on the fishing hut. Awesome. This is looking fantastic. We have let's get our let's leave let's actually we're gonna leave our bed there. Are we gonna leave our bed there? Yeah, we're gonna leave our bed there because we're actually gonna go ahead and oh I can fill that in. We're gonna build our farm down here. I want a good veggie farm going. And I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, where do I wanna build it? Because I wanna be kind of nearby the fishing hut. Um I'm thinking, how about over here? There's a lot of gravel to clear up. There's a cave there, so we're gonna be digging under the cave. Over here, I'm thinking, maybe we'll make it right in front. Hmm. Okay, guys. So, here is the progress. I've done uh, the digging. This digging took forever, by the way. Um, You know, I've, I ran across something, though. You guys hear that? I ran across something. Hopefully that skeleton's not over here still. Where is it? Well, somewhere over here. Somewhere. Make a liar out of me. Oh wait, I think it's lower. I think they're lower. <laughs> there, I opened, I, I heard a bunch of mobs, right? And um, so I thought, okay, well maybe there's a spawner. I think it's over here. Oh, there they are. Okay, there they are. Um, ouch. <laughs> so I don't know if there's a spawner in there, but I saw all these mobs. The only reason why I haven't done anything yet though is because I saw a creeper in here. There was a creeper chilling in, uh, yeah. Daphne does not mess with creepers <laughs> oh I think I heard him I think I heard him if I could just dispose of him there's a little there's a parrot over here she's over here somewhere she was making uh, she was making spider noises and she was making creeper noises so I wonder if it's because of this creeper I don't know possibly hello I really don't want to go in there you know I could stop this water Help you out, bro. Does the water stop? There it goes. There you go. You're welcome. You're welcome. Don't let me fall in there. So I don't think I don't think that there's I don't think that there's a um a spawner in here. Where in the world is shooting from? What the heck? Where was that from? <laughs> Somebody shot me, but I don't even know where it was from. I'll have to go explore that later. What the heck? That was weird. And then I heard a zombie. I don't know. That was weird. That was absolutely weird. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> All right. So let's get into the build. Um, all right, so let's go ahead. We're gonna have to craft up. I have my crafting table way over here. Let's make a little jump for it there. Whoops, missed. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna make some more slabs here. Gonna make some more jungle wood first. And then we can go ahead and make some slabs. Um, so this is the look I'm going for as far as our farming, our garden, our farming veggies uh, or whatnot. Um, but right here... In this little vicinity, I'm going to be digging that out later because we're going to make some, make us some automatic farms. I made an automatic farm for the first time in Unity, and I absolutely loved it. It was an awesome, easy build. So I think I'm going to go ahead and bring that here as well um, so that we can go ahead and make, easily make carrots, potatoes, and all that once they come, become available. Once we're able to find a village or possibly get a zombie to drop a carrot for us.
Um, so I think that's about the route. I'm going to go with that. Now this farm, oh, good grief. <laughs> it's dark in here. Let's see. Um, whatever. I'm just going <laughs> to move it out of the way. Um, now for sugarcane farms and whatever, um, I actually I'm going to build one, but it's going to be completely separate considering, um, I'm going to need to make it. I think I should make it an automatic sugarcane farm. That'd be like the smartest idea. Put the water there. And then we are going to go like a so. And like I said, we're going to get eventually get some hay bales or get some uh, lily pads in here. And we can just use them to close up the... I don't know if it's going to hydrate the, all the way this way. I don't think it's going to. But we are going to... Let's get some more water here. Going to put some water here. Is it going to go here or here? Here. I think this is the best place for it. Oh, got hiccups. Okay, we're gonna go like that. Okay, almost done here. It looks like it's, for the meantime, working. Now, we don't have a lot of veggies to plant right now. All we have is wheat seeds, basically. We have pumpkin seeds as well, or melon seeds. Um, pumpkin seeds, did I ever get any? I don't think I ever got any. Okay, we gotta get some more lighting in here as well. I think lighting is like a big deal kind of needed in this uh, situation um let's just go ahead and plant and then here as well great great and then we can go ahead and just plant it here too now we need melon seeds which we can plant these just randomly placed here hopefully we're giving them enough room to um yeah hopefully we're giving them enough room they need that little space Let's see here, oh, boop, and then boop. There we go. All right, so we now have, oh, there you are. <gasps> Guys, we have a zombie villager. I really, really want to keep him. Oh, good grief, where am I going to put you? You're going to die if I bring you out here in the open. Oh, no. Just keep running. Oh, my gosh, he almost got me. Okay, you can go here. Oh no! <laughs> Stay right there. Okay guys, he's officially trapped. I think he's officially trapped. Okay, yeah, he's not getting out of this one. No, he's not. Sweet guys, we have a villager and possibly our first resident of uh, our little ravine city here. Yep, possibly. All right, so he's he's nice and trapped in there. Um, I think I'm gonna go ahead. I should probably probably put some put a little roof on it or something, I guess, because he might uh, burn up. I don't know if that's actually gonna protect him. It may or may not. I'm not sure. Um, let's go ahead and just close all this off though, just to keep the sun from hitting him. All right, dude, you are gonna be in the way of our our next build here. <laughs> I was going to build the archway of our little uh plant our little uh farming area but i guess that's going to be out of the question right now good grief but we did get a zombie villager sweet um but anyways guys i think that's going to be it for today's episode i think we got a lot done today we got a fishing hut we got a, a disc and music for good old toucan our luscious beautiful bird and then of course we got a zombie villager unexpected uh, little goal set for today but we got him um and i don't know he could be a cartographer that'd be sweet can you imagine guys going to a woodland mansion episode three that'd be great um <laughs> not episode three but episode four or five uh, but anyways guys that's gonna be it for today again like i said and uh it was really great hanging out with you guys today hopefully you guys did enjoy as always i love you all and i'll see you next time bye